Hey guys, what's up? It's once again mp4podcast.com. Today we're taking a look at two browsers that have full flash support. Now I know it's 2013 and you know a lot of mobile devices don't really need flash really that much, but there are still a couple of sites that use flash that where it does come in handy actually, such as hulu.com. So what we're going to do is take a look at Photon and then Puffin. Now I have reviewed these browsers previously. Uh, but these browsers have been significantly updated a lot. Okay, so let's just go over to Hulu.com. And right now, Photon Browser is not in the cloud mode. So what we're going to do is we're just going to go over to uh, Google. As you can see, I'm just typing in Google. Let me show you why. And uh, just do .com. And now what you want to do is click on the lightning bolt over here. Now this whole entire browser is completely going in the cloud. So, you know, everything is being rendered in the cloud. Okay, as you can see, the lightning bolt is um, is not there. And if I click on this little uh, square with the, I don't know, see if you get that in focus, with the uh, planet Earth, that will bring it back into native mode. So now we're going to go back to Hulu and because we, we don't want Hulu uh, to know that we're the same person that's why we're going to uh, go that's why we went to uh, Google and then that's why we're coming back alright now for just content ID reasons because sometimes I do get flagged for these videos um, just going to turn the volume uh, pretty low I'm just going to pick one video, oops, and I'm just going to um, play, I'll play The Office. Alright, now what you can do is you can just turn the, turn the device this way, and if you want to watch it like in a little bit, a little bit um, better um, view, you just go full screen right over here. And um, you just pick the ad so the flash works just like a computer. So this is working out pretty well. And I'm just going to go like this and just talk over it because uh, for content ID reasons, I'll just come back to it uh, right after this commercial is done. Because um, sometimes some of these companies, can get, they can uh, you know get me flagged for videos. So it, right now it's going to focus in. And uh, I would say that looks pretty good. It's a little bit choppy. It's not too bad. It's still watchable. I would say, it's, you know, if you need to watch an episode here and there, it's uh, not too bad because paying for the, the uh, Hulu support for uh, any iOS devices or other devices is like $8, $9 a month. I'll turn out the volume just a little bit. All right, let me lower that now. All right, now what we're going to do is go to Puffin. And I'm going to start a Puffin. Now, Puffin works a little bit different. Puffin uh, does have cloud support. However, it only in, encodes the embedded vid, uh, Flash videos. So... Um, you know, like if you if you know like web designing, uh, the video is uh, separate than the, than the web page. It's embedded into the page. So uh, it, what it does is it just finds the embed code, and then sends that over to the Puffin service to be re-encoded for your device. So here we'll play the Office. And there it's um, encoding right there. Let's just flip this over just like this. Just want to give you a tip. It, sometimes when it plays commercials, you'll get a little pop-up thing watching full screen. It'll do that for the commercials, but don't it won't it'll have problems when you're watching the television the you know the shows on Hulu. So you know, with this, you know, you can just go like that. 
Maybe you can stretch it out just a little bit like that. So that's actually not a bad picture right there. As you can see right there. So just go like this for copyright reasons. Um, now that I, I like both of them. I like Puffin and Photon. Before I preferred Photon hands down because uh, Puffin wasn't really there. Uh, but they did upgrade it and it has really become a phenomenal browser. As you can see, this is the uh, Puffin one. Now I just want to show you one other thing. There is a free version of Puffin. Um, so you can get Puffin for free. I don't think there's any limits on it. However, the full version is, I believe, 99 cents. Uh, however, I, I still recommend buying it, even though there's a free version. If you can spare a dollar, it actually goes into the servers and helps maintain the maintenance uh, so we can have these features. So let's just keep that in mind. I think Photon, I, if I, can't, I can't, can't remember the price. I think it was like uh, $2.99. Uh, and then there's the iPad version. So, um, you know, so again, I like to have both of them just because if Puffin servers are having a problem or Photon servers are having a problem or maybe, you know, Hulu's blocking Puffin or Photon or whatever it, the case may be, I at least have an alternative. So I really like them both and... Um, yeah, um, they're really uh, both really good browsers. So definitely add them to your iOS devices. Now the iPad version, there is an iPad uh, Photon version. Uh, it's not a uh, universal app. Just keep that in mind if you if you purchase it, um, because you'll have to uh, hit two X to blow it up, and um, you'd probably want to just get the full version. But both very good browsers. Uh, there is another Flash browser, it's called Cloud Browser. Now Cloud Browser, I don't have it installed right here, but um, because I'm just talking about Hulu, Cloud Browser only gives you 10 minutes uh, of rendering, and I think they have, it, they have a paid service, you have to pay a certain amount of uh, money. But that's not a bad browser as well, maybe you might be at another website that might be having some problems, you want to check something out. So Cloud Browser, I definitely recommend that one too. Um, just for a, a quick backup for certain things and that browser I think is 99 cents or a dollar 99 But anyway guys if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe to the channel always doing more tech videos all the time And uh, if you can help me out, please give me a thumbs up. If you have any questions leave a comment below. Take care guys. Later guys. Bye